What if I told you that a car exists that never needs gas, never needs charging, and can run indefinitely on its own power? Imagine a device so powerful that it can light up your entire home, office, or even a whole community without ever paying a single electricity bill. Sounds impossible, right? That's exactly what the oil giants, utility companies, and mainstream media want you to believe. Because if you knew the truth, their billion-dollar industries could collapse overnight. Today, I'm going to share a story that feels like science fiction, but is unfolding right now. For years, one man's inventions were dismissed, ignored, and even suppressed. But in a shocking update, his revolutionary cars and energy devices are now available to the public. By the end of this video, you'll know who this man is how his technology works, and exactly how you can finally buy these world-changing creations for yourself. The man behind these groundbreaking innovations is Maxwell Chikambutso, a self-taught engineer and inventor from Zimbabwe. Unlike most inventors, Maxwell didn't have a world-class laboratory or billions in funding. He started with almost nothing, yet he went on to design technologies that many experts once claimed were impossible. He is best known for developing the world's first self-charging electric car, a prototype helicopter, a drone, a mobile broadcast station, and most importantly, microsonic energy devices capable of generating clean power without fuel. For years, Maxwell's inventions attracted curiosity, but also skepticism and resistance. Why? Because they directly threatened some of the largest and most powerful industries in the world, oil, energy, and automotive. But while critics laughed and doubted, something remarkable was happening. Behind the scenes, Maxwell continued refining his inventions. And today, the world is finally paying attention. Let's talk about the car that started it all. Maxwell Chikambutso's self-charging electric vehicle. Unlike Tesla or other electric cars, which require frequent charging stations, Maxwell's car generates its own electricity while driving. The vehicle uses a built-in clean energy generator that continuously powers the motor. This means it can run indefinitely without ever plugging into a charger or stopping at a gas station. To put it into perspective, think of every frustration you've ever had with cars. High gas prices, range anxiety, long charging times. Now imagine all of that disappearing overnight. A car that never needs fuel could save families thousands of dollars every year. For businesses, it could transform entire fleets of vehicles. But here's the unsettling truth. A technology like this could also obliterate oil companies, dismantle charging station networks, and disrupt economies built around fuel. That's why many people believe Maxwell's technology was deliberately ignored for years. Because if it spreads, trillions of dollars in profit vanish. Yet despite the resistance, the car exists. And now, for the first time, you can actually buy it. Now let's move to the invention that could transform your daily life even more, the microsonic energy device. This small, compact unit generates continuous, clean energy without fuel or traditional electricity. Imagine plugging this device into your home and never paying an electricity bill again. Imagine schools, hospitals, and entire communities in developing nations powered by these devices without depending on unstable grids or expensive imports. It's not just about saving money. It's about freedom. Energy independence. For decades, people have been told that power generation requires massive plants, dangerous fossil fuels, or complex grids. Maxwell's device breaks that myth completely. And here's where the suspense deepens. These devices are scalable. That means whether you want to power a small home, a large business, or even a city block, they can be adapted to fit. If adopted worldwide, this invention could literally rewrite the global energy map. So if these technologies are so revolutionary, why haven't you heard about them everywhere? Why aren't governments and corporations jumping to support Maxwell Chikumbutso? The uncomfortable answer is suppression. History shows that disruptive inventions often face resistance, not because they don't work, but because they threaten existing power structures. Oil companies don't want cars that never need fuel. Utility companies don't want homes powered independently. And politicians don't want to lose control of billion-dollar energy infrastructures. This is why innovators like Maxwell are often labeled as frauds or conspiracy theorists. It's easier to silence someone than to allow their ideas to spread. But truth has a way of resurfacing. 
and Maxwell's persistence has finally broken through the barriers. Now, for the first time, we're seeing his inventions move beyond prototypes and demonstrations into real-world availability. Here's the groundbreaking update. Maxwell Chikumbutso's self-charging cars and microsonic energy devices are now being made available for purchase. After years of research, demonstrations, and global skepticism, these inventions are finally reaching the public. While availability may still be limited and production small-scale, the fact that they can now be bought at all is historic. This is not just a scientific breakthrough. It's a moment that could define the future of transportation and energy. Imagine being among the first people to own a self-charging car. Imagine powering your entire home with a device no bigger than a suitcase. It's not just about saving money. It's about living in a world where ordinary people control their own energy and mobility. And that world is starting right now. Let's step back and think about what this means. If these inventions scale globally, entire industries could collapse. Oil companies would lose dominance. Power utilities would be forced to adapt or vanish. Even governments that rely on energy revenues could face economic upheaval. But for ordinary people, this is liberation. Free energy could mean more disposable income, better living conditions, and a more sustainable planet. Cars that don't need fuel could cut emissions dramatically. Communities could thrive without depending on unstable grids. This isn't just about cars and devices. It's about reshaping civilization itself. If you're fascinated by these updates and want to stay ahead of the curve as new information emerges, make sure to hit that subscribe button right now. Because let's be honest, the mainstream media will not keep you updated on this story. But here, you'll get the raw truth as it happens. And I want to hear from you. Do you believe powerful corporations will allow this technology to succeed? Or will they try to shut it down again? Drop your thoughts in the comments. I'll be reading and replying, we've come full circle, from whispers of impossible inventions, to suppressed prototypes, to the shocking reality that these technologies are finally available for purchase. This isn't a dream anymore. Maxwell Chikambutso's self-charging cars and microsonic energy devices are here. They represent not just innovation, but a new chapter in human history. For decades, we've been told there's no alternative to fossil fuels, no escape from electricity bills, no way out of systems designed to keep us dependent. Today, that narrative is breaking apart. The world is changing, and you are witnessing it happen in real time. So here's the question. Are we ready for a world where energy is free? And cars run without fuel forever? Because that world is no longer fantasy. It's unfolding before our eyes. Maxwell Chikumbutso has given humanity a glimpse of what's possible. The only question left is whether society will embrace it, or whether the old powers will try to stop it. If you want to stay updated on this incredible story, make sure to subscribe and turn on notifications. Because this is just the beginning, and you won't want to miss what comes next. And I'll leave you with this final thought. If you had the chance to own one of these cars or devices, would you take it? Drop your answer in the comments. I'm excited to see where you stand.